Hey guys, Mike from B Tech Reviews here. And I'm actually on my way to my uh, brother-in-law's house or my sister's house to go check out a, a ride uh, that he just purchased. Uh, and backstory to this uh, vehicle that he just recently got, which is a 19, or it's a 2002, I believe it's an 02 Forerunner. And I'm driving, but let me let me back out here so you guys, so I can uh, continue the story here. Uh, but anyways, backstory to this uh, specific vehicle is we went to go see it yesterday, right? He's been looking for kind of like a, a used off-roader also. Okay, hold on, let me, <laughs> let me turn the wheel here. And I'm gonna post this on YouTube, guys, so that we can check it out. Um, but basically, backstory to this is, you know, he's, you know, he's been wanting a, uh, a car for a while now, or a, an SUV that's uh, four x four capable, right? And uh, we went to go, uh, we've been looking for a while. We had seen already one or two vehicles within the past couple weeks. Uh, specifically, you know, he, he really wanted a Toyota. So, so basically uh, we went, and again, I can't believe I'm holding this while driving. Uh, but don't worry guys, I'm keeping my eyes out on the road, okay? So anyways, uh, we went and uh, we, we looked for, we, we've been looking for vehicles and I found one a couple nights ago on Facebook Marketplace, right? And that one or whatever, that specific vehicle, um, you know, the guy was asking initially 3K for it. So when we went to go see it, you know, overall it's in pretty great condition. You know, the guy had it, you know, it was clean. But the thing is we live in South Texas and, uh, the, uh, the forerunners from Illinois, or Michigan, excuse me. So he he's had it, you know, it's got rust issues because of the salt and whatnot that, that goes on over there on the roads. Uh, nothing too major from what I'm seeing, and I'm gonna show you guys as soon as I get there. We'll just do a quick walk around of the vehicle. And, you know, I'm not sure if he's gonna mod it up anytime soon, uh, but if he does, we'll check it out. But. Uh, we'll see how that goes. Okay, I'm, I'm excited for him because he's been wanting like a, a nice little uh, off-roader that you know he can take to the beach or some somewhere that he can take off-roading around around the area. So uh, I'm on the way there. Let's go ahead and check it out, guys. Okay. All right. So here is the 2002 Toyota 4Runner again. This is a sports edition. I've never seen any uh, with this specific badge, so that's pretty interesting. Again, it's a 2002. Uh, we're in South Texas again. It's from Illinois. You know, it's got a few quirks here and there, but for the most part, this is a clean Toyota 4Runner, okay? I mean, again, there's very very to zero minimal body damage. Just a little few dings here and there, like, you know, like there on the hood, that's no big deal, you know what I mean? A little bit of rust on some of the bumpers. Again, no nothing too major. Crazy stuff here, but we're just doing a quick walk around. Look at that. They even blacked out the Toyota logo for us. Or maybe I'm just seeing it like that. Hello. Uh, looks like they have a, one of the Spectrum guys working on the internet here. But but overall, man, dude, this is a super clean Toyota 4Runner, man. I mean, the wheels are kind of dirty. I think the guy actually had replaced the, the rear tire. So the rear tires are actually new again. But again, uh, if I can get the key or, or it's actually open. Hey, hey, never mind. Okay. The door's open. Thanks a lot, brother-in-law, for leaving it open. So interior wise super clean no ugly smells he says the sunroof works also has a sunroof and again this is the reason why he got it because it's four by four and you know super clean dash for the most part no cracks it does have a little bit of uh scratching here and there a little bit of uh, a cut off right here for the middle center console which isn't a big deal you can probably get that replaced later on but for the most part you know, it's got clean floors here. He detailed it from the looks of it. Looks clean. Let me see if the back's open. I mean, probably one of the cleanest forerunners again you'll see from from the year. Yes, it does have rust issues. I mean, again, this came from Illinois, so you know he's gonna have that. He might end up taking it somewhere to try to get the rust removed. Again, you know, I don't know if he's gonna take the time to put money into it, but for the most part, guys, man. I'm just very impressed and shocked at the same time. Again, this is a 2002 Toyota 4Runner. Again, this is a SR5 four-wheel drive. And, you know, again, a little bit of rust here and there. Nothing too crazy. Again, nothing that's going to screw up the functionality of the actual vehicle. And I like how it has a hitch that has the Toyota emblem on it already. So that's pretty cool. But, okay, guys, this is Mike from DTEC signing off. 
Again, not too, too much damage here. Just a little bit of stuff here and there, nothing too crazy. Again, you know, I don't know if he's gonna get any type of body work done on this. For the most part, I am just in awe. The $2,200 2002 Forerunner, which is, which is funny because it's a 20, it's a 2002, I believe, and he paid 2,200 for it. So again, guys, this is Mike from BTEC signing off. This is just a quick overview of the vehicle you know if you guys like this video give it a thumbs up if you guys like my channel please subscribe if i can i will post more update videos on this as my brother-in-law uh, continues to fix it up and clean it up so again this is mike signing off we'll see you guys next time